Yo, what's up YouTube? In today's video, I'm going law fishing down the canal with this bait caster reel here and I've got some laws in my pocket so I'm going to get down there right now. Well guys, I have arrived at the canal here and I'm going to start walking down this way with the law and I'm just going to cast it out, have two or three goes in this bit then move along a couple metres couple down there you know what I mean sort of thing and then we'll end up a couple bridges down and then make my way back up and see what we might catch just to mention that I have got this little box here full of lures these are lures here these ones are flies from my fly fishing rod but um, I've got a couple of lures in there a spinner that one is terrible so I won't be using that and then I've got a worm there so let's get I'll um, start switching these up along as we go. I've got a little soft lure on at the moment, so yeah. So guys, I'm just here now. I've moved along the canal quite a bit. And I'm just casting out just like so, and reeling in really slowly. Letting the fish see the swim bait. It's like a, a bright green one actually. I'll show you. you know, let me get this in quickly, I'll show you this. It's like a little swim bait. And um, it's green, got a hook on. Jig head as well. I like yeah, I jigged it myself, quite proud of myself, that was the best one I ever did, so yeah, I'm just going to keep casting out and um, I'll let you know guys if I get anything. So it is time to switch up the law, I've been going for a while and I've not caught nothing with this one, so I'm going to pop that in there and I think I'm going to use this one now. So I'm going to give you guys a quick tip for if you have one of these bait casters. When you put a new lure on, you're going to want to set the weight of it sort of. So you flick that down there and turn this towards you until you see that your lure starts to drop, which mine just has. There we go. So I'll flick that up now, reel it up, and there we go. I'm ready to fish. And that just prevents this getting bird nested up. Guys, I'm feeling like sort of little bites on the bottom. I'm not sure it's me being snagged on twigs or something, but I'm feeling sort of like there another one. When you when you're reeling in slowly, you sort of feel like a tug, and it's like I'm not sure if they're bites. So I hope they are. This new law swims beautifully, by the way. I don't know if you can see that in the water, but it swims really beautifully and stands out. Amazing. So let's get um fishing again So guys, I've put on a new law. This one is like a massive jumbo worm on this big jig head here. And um, hopefully, I, I'm feeling this one will get a big, absolutely massive perch. It's got a good shot, and the worm kind of has a scent to it as well, which is a good thing. So yeah, let's see if we can catch some on this. Guys, what should have taken me five minutes to walk to this little bit of bridge from where I was starting, has now took me an hour and a half to walk to this bridge with the, the, the law rod and I've actually still caught nothing on this bad boy. I'm really surprised as well because I've changed the law against that big worm. I've changed the laws three times because I've been not catching on either of them and I still haven't caught so I don't know what I'm doing wrong. That does not stop me. I'm going right through because just past here is the spot I actually was going to fish at. It's sort of like a wolf, and it's down there. Haha, <laughs> their little structures doesn't stop me. But I'm at this little wolf here, and people have caught pike here before, who I know. And then, um, yeah, so fingers crossed, I should get one. So now that I've arrived at the new spot, I've attached this spinner lure on, spin a little spin bait thing, and that'll, these are good for catching pike. This is actually the person who I know what caught pike on this down here so 
I'm going to try and cast it under this little bridge here and then I'll move down to the wharf. Fingers crossed we'll get one. Fish rod? No, joking. I've snagged on something. So let's um, get this one snagged and then I can finally fish again. So guys, here we are at this beautiful wharf here. There's got to be some pike here. Even if it's not a pike, it's some fish. And that over there looks like there could be. Looks like the sort of area to be some carp. Some grass carp or whatever. So fingers crossed we get one of them on a lure. No, that's definitely not happening. But we could always come back here in another video and try and get some. Bait at the spot for a few weeks, get some tench maybe. Whilst I was fishing, the canal is up there by the way. I've just stumbled across this field with a bunch of sheep in. And I, I came in and there's this little little tiny river stream looking thing. There could be some minnows in here. Who knows, maybe another 28 pound pike. Doubt that. <laughs> um, there is bubbles coming up though. That could be plants photosynthesizing or whatever you call it, but um, I might add a few casts out with the little oh, See what we might catch. Absolutely nothing is my prediction, but if we got some, that would be cool. And then I'll get back on the canal. Yep, let's scrap that idea. There's definitely no fish in there that I could catch on a lure. Maybe on a tiny hook there is, but I don't know. Save that for another video. For now, I'm going to start walking back up to where I started. Because it's getting quite breezy and, and cloudy. Looks like it's about to rain and I have no coat. And I don't really want to get stuck out here in a storm or whatever. So, I'm going to start walking back. I'm just going to cast out and keep fishing along the way up, obviously. See what I catch. Hopefully, I get something, but... If I don't get some, don't be disappointed because I will film more videos on lure fishing until I catch one. So I'm almost back now, not too far to go. I'm back on the first stretch of the canal that I was on. And I've been fishing along the way. For now, I'm just walking. I've got the rod in my hand, obviously. And I am just walking along. The lure's in the water. I've still got the spin lure on. It's a lovely lure that is actually, it swims really nicely and I'm not sure how it hasn't caught a fish but you know, you win some you lose some and lure fishing in the UK is not the best at all so you have to be in amazing, absolutely stacked rivers and whatnot, stacked parts of the canals so um, you have to be lucky really so yeah. So guys I've reached back to where I started and I think I'm just going to head home now because I've been out for a good three hours walking the stretches of the canal and I've had no luck apart from like a few little snag bites, I'm not sure really but yeah, so I've packed, packed the rod away, I've just hooked the lure onto the top so and now I'm just going to walk home now Well if you guys enjoyed that video make sure to smash the thumbs up button please share it about, get to as many views as you can turn on the post notifications and most of all subscribe to my channel please and yeah if you enjoyed this video as well, you make sure to check out some of my other videos there, there, and obviously subscribe to my channel, please. So yeah, for now, I'll see you in the next one, and peace.